How rich do you think the leaders of the world are? What colossal amount of wealth do these people have stored in their bank accounts and where do they spend it? Today we're going to take a look at just that. Stick to the end of the video to learn more. But before we take a look at the 5 richest presidents in the world, don't forget to drop a like, subscribe, and turn on post notifications to never miss a new video. Also, make sure to watch till the end so you don't miss anything. Without further ado, let's dive right in. Number 5. Khalifa bin Zayed Al Nayyan, President of United Arab Emirates Starting off the list, we have the president of one of the richest empires of the world. The Saudis have ruled the oil and gas industry for decades, and that has paid off, with them having some of the most extravagant lifestyles on earth. From gold-plated furniture to million-dollar mega-yachts, the Saudis are notorious for how they flash their wealth. Well, the president of these people is bound to be just as rich, right? Exactly. Khalifa bin Zayed Al Nayyan, President of the United Arab Emirates, has an estimated net worth of $15 billion. Khalifa Zayed Al Nayyan took over the position of the President of the UAE after his father, Zayed bin Sultan Al Nayyan, the previous ruler, passed. Now since the family is a dynasty and the crown is passed on from one generation to the next, the wealth also piles up. Khalifa Zayad Al Nayyan has a ton of money and he's not afraid to show it off. As the president of the UAE, he's expected to live in style and that's exactly what he does. The Khalifa has his own super yacht that he uses to travel across the seven seas with his family. This super yacht is named Azam and it's not only the largest yacht on the planet but also one of the most expensive ones to ever exist. The Zam super yacht is worth a staggering $600 million and is the yacht of choice when it comes to luxurious living. Now for his house, Khalifa Zayad Al Nayyan owns many, the most notable being the Al Batin Palace. Other than this, the Khalifa owns a number of homes including Ascot Place, a mansion the Sheikh bought in 1989 for a then record of $22 million and another property in London which he bought for $6.2 million but hasn't visited it once because it's too small for his staff. Imagine being so rich your staff alone is too big for a $6.2 million mansion. Number 4. Abdullah bin Abdulaziz Al Saud The King of Saudi Arabia, oil capital of the world is the fourth richest president on our list with an estimated net worth of a jaw-dropping $18 billion. This isn't a big deal since he controlled 20% of the world's most valuable oil reserves and was the leader of the Al Saud family. The Al Saud family or the Saudi royal family has a net worth of $1.4 trillion and has a lifestyle that can rival that of any other person in the world. Famous for their spontaneous purchases of multi-million dollar yachts and mansions, they don't think twice when it comes to spending. The king himself is a big fan of spending and owns several yachts including the Tuk super yacht worth $11 million. His other expenditures are however more generous in nature and publicly the king was famous for his contributions and donations to charity. He also recently had two Liberboos built for what was called as the academic progress of the Muslim world. King Abdullah, as you might have guessed by now, was a devout Muslim. He would meet with religious leaders twice a month to get guidance. His son, Prince Mohammed bin Salman, on the other hand, is a bit more materialistic and burns through cash like there's no tomorrow. In 2015, Mohammed bin Salman spent $299 million to acquire a large mansion in France called Chateau Louis XIV. And in 2017, he purchased a super yacht called Serene for $500 million. Serene, like the previous yacht owned by the Arabs we mentioned, is one of the most expensive yachts on the planet and the one known and loved by yacht enthusiasts everywhere due to its extravagant and over-the-top design choices. Number 3. Hassan al Bolkai, Sultan of Brunei Chances are you've probably never heard of Brunei. And if you haven't, it's a place that has the third richest president in the world. Hassan al bokai is the Sultan of Brunei and has one of the most lavish lifestyles one could ever imagine. This man has a lifestyle most people would never even dream of. Sure, he has a net worth of $30 billion, but the lifestyle is something you would not believe. Let's take a look at how he lives. You've probably seen car enthusiasts buy cars they like. All rich people do it, and a lot of them have pretty extravagant collections. 
Well, Hassan al Bolkai takes it to a whole new level. He owns the most expensive car collection in the world, worth an estimated $5 billion. The Sultan even owns a gold-plated Rolls-Royce. And although the exact number of cars he owns is not publicly available, some of the publicly available records confirm that he owns 600 Rolls-Royces, 550 Mercedes-Benzes, 450 Ferraris. The Nobel cars include 8 Ferrari F40s, at one point he owned 11, 3 Ferrari LaFerraris, 1 Ferrari Enzo, 1 Ferrari F90 Testarossa. Taking a break from cars, if we take a look at his estates, those are just as unbelievable. A 1788 room palace, the largest private home in the world, and his very own zoo with 30 imported Bengal tigers. The Sultan is a fan of music too, and for his 50th birthday, he had the King of Pop, Michael Jackson himself, flown in to perform for him. No one, I repeat, no one can come even close to the lavish style this guy has. Number 2. Bumabal Adil Yadej, King of Thailand The longest reigning monarch in the world, Bumabal Adil Yadej, ruled over Thailand for 70 years. During these 70 years, he amassed a net worth of more than $30 billion. This wealth, unlike the lavish spending of the previous presidents, was spent sensibly by Bumabal Adil Yadej. The king had an entire bupre that was designated to do the job of being his financial advisor and handled all his finances the best way they could. This meant that smart investments instead of extravagant spending was done. And at the end of his life, Bumabal owned 3,300 acres of real estate in central Bangkok, as well as 13,200 acres of country land and property. The king also owned a 32% stake in Siam Cement, worth an estimated $13 billion. He also owns 23% of Siam Commercial Bank, the largest bank in Thailand, as well as stakes in an insurance company, the Shin Corporation, a conglomerate of telecommunication, media, aviation, advertising, and finance companies. These smart investment choices weren't the only thing that this guy did right. King Bumabal was also a much-loved leader, and a significant portion of the population actually believed that he was a deity and worshipped him. Disrespecting the king was a punishable offense, and after his death, the fame and fortune enjoyed by the royal family dropped down significantly. Number 1. Vladimir Putin Grabbing first place with a mind-blowing net worth of $70 billion is the one and only Vladimir Putin. Vladimir Putin is one of the most well-known presidents in the world. His net worth is kept hidden from the public, and various estimates put it as high as $200 billion. This is because in 2007, President Putin declared a net worth of $150,000, but at the same time owned 11 luxury yachts and stakes of some big Russian companies like the oil company Sergat Neftegas and the natural gas one Gazprom. Putin owns a palace measuring 123,785 square feet, twice the size of Buckingham Palace in London and it was declared in a political dossier by critic Boris Nemtsov that Putin has 43 planes, 7,000 cars, and 15 helicopters, including an Ayushin jet with an $89,000 gold toilet. Other analysts have guesstimated that Putin is worth 60 times more than Donald Trump, and these assets are actually hidden by him and the Russian KGB. Putin has made his wealth over the length of his entire career, starting as KGB agent to a successful investor and now a multi-time president of the Russian Federation. That was a closer look at five of the richest presidents in the world. What's the first thing you would buy with this kind of wealth? Comment and let us know down below. This has been Lexer Luxury. See you next time. Stay hungry.